Today in this Minecraft tutorial video, I'm going to show you on how to get floating text. Now in Minecraft, there's a few ways that you can get floating text. The first way is by using commands. Now getting commands to work, it can be a little bit finicky at times, so I wouldn't expect a beginner to know exactly how to get the text to work. By using a mob, this is going to be the most survival friendly way that you can do this, besides using an item inside of an item frame. For any mob inside the game, you can go and rename them with a the name tag as well know. Then you can go place them inside of a hole. Then you can go ahead and have the text pop up and let other people see it around the areas. But there's one problem. You can't really place them above ground because if you do so, then you're just going to be seeing the mob. You can't even make them invisible. If you try to make them invisible, the name does not appear, which is very, very frustrating. So you're not going to be able to use mobs in a very good way. But if you were to use an item frame with an item inside of there, while you can still see the text, you can't really item underground, which is a very big flaw with them. But most importantly, you're going to be seeing just the item frame with the item, and that's not very good either. But today, we're going to be using a Minecraft add-on, which makes things a lot easier, because you don't have to rely on mobs. You don't have to rely on commands, and you don't have to rely on item frame because this is a spawn egg that you can find in the creative section. So we're going to name this Minecraft. If I go ahead and grab this, and I go ahead and place it down, then look at that. We have ourselves our floating text, and the best part is, it's above ground. You don't have to worry about burying it underground, which is just really good. But also, you can go and place this wherever you want. So if I place it right there, then look at that. We have ourselves the name above this block. If I break this block, it's still going to be there. So this is going to be one of the best options to use if you want floating text inside your game. So you're more than likely going to be able to use this on your servers. You can use this on your worlds. I mean, whatever you want to use it on, then you definitely can go and do that. As long as creator allows it, then it's absolutely fine. And down below in the description, you will be able to go and download this and play around with it within your own creations. But I do want to hear your thoughts below in the comments of what you think of this. If you enjoyed this video or found it interesting, then please let me know by leaving a like on it and subscribe so you don't miss any uploads by me in the future because I do add-on showcases every single week and if you don't subscribe, then you're going to miss them. It's not very good. But for now, I hope you have a logical day and I'll catch you next time. Bye.